If you've got a dog and live near a beach, chances are one of your pooch's favorite activities is to play catch on the water's edge. Well, we've got a warning for you and your pet. That sand on the tennis ball or the frisbee could be very, very dangerous for your dog. There's danger lurking in the sand that many dog owners don't know exists. A playful dig along the shore, a game of fetch with a sand-soaked ball, even a simple frolic on the beach. It could all lead to sand impaction. That happens when a dog ingests too much sand, leading to a painful blockage in the intestines seen here in x-rays. Yeah, I was really surprised. These dog owners had no idea that ingesting sand could be a health hazard for their husky Maya. As we head into this busy holiday beach weekend, veterinarian Dr. Jeff Werber warns sand ingestion is common. They're going to pick it up when they're chasing the ball or chasing the frisbee or running along the beach. They're ultimately going to ingest sand. He says a serious case of sand impaction can cause stomach pain and vomiting. When it gets wet, just like when you're building a sand castle, it gets very solid and heavy and it just sits there. And ultimately, if it makes its way out of the stomach and into the intestine, it can cause a blockage. So what to do? It's very important to wipe the ball off. Every time they come back, check their mouths inside, the, check the jowls, make sure they brush all the sand away from their faces, because if it's still stuck there, what do they do? They start licking it. Great tips so that your pup can safely enjoy these dog days of summer. And if the hot sand feels like it's burning your feet, our expert says it's also burning your dog's paws, so it's time to go home.